Hey friends, so let's go here. I'm making this video in part because it's an important part of my own story, and also in case it helps anyone else who's going through something similar or know, who knows someone who is. And I'm going to open with an Irish joke, of all things, uh, the best version of which I found on, on Word Reference. So it goes like this. A traveller stops to ask a farmer the way to a small village. The farmer thinks for a while and then says, if you want to go there, I wouldn't start from here. Now that joke has been playing on my mind for the last couple of years. I wouldn't start from here. Now my story is that a couple of years ago, uh, roughly New Year 2017-18, I burnt out. And what I mean by that is not just that I had a general loss of interest in work um, and I couldn't perform highly, it means that I woke up one morning and had, looking back, a fairly serious dissociative episode. So the way I experienced that was I would look at my laptop screen that morning and instead of seeing emails and Outlook, I saw shapes, colors and lights. I couldn't make sense of the idea that there were people behind those emails or information and things to do. It was just the screen. Similarly, I would look at other people and I had no theory of mind. Surely they didn't have their own subjective experience. It was more like they were non-player characters, just like I was. And it didn't go away that quickly. It slowly recovered. Um, but as I took some time off work, eventually went back to work after I think a week or two, um, I slowly recovered to a kind of 50 to 70% of where I was level. So I couldn't re-engage with work. I couldn't get back the level of performance and interest even that I had before, before this happened. And I should say as well, the main cause of this was just working way too much. And there, there are a couple of other things in life going on, but I think the main factor was working too many hours with no boundaries for far too long. So what happened was I tried to restart my interest um, and my commitment to work in that job. I lasted about a year and a half and things got fine. I never really got beyond 70% and um, having gone from someone who was quite a high performer before then to someone who kind of slightly disappeared and just did the job. I wasn't doing a bad job, but I wasn't doing a particularly great job either. I then got the opportunity to move jobs, which I took, and I thought this would be a good chance to wipe the slate clean and um, just start again somewhere else. And it helped for a bit, but it didn't really help. As soon as the pressure came on and the requirement to work long hours and that kind of thing kicked in, I had this kind of defense mechanism of like, no, 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 not doing that. And I couldn't bring back that high performance that I had before that I really valued in myself. Um, I, I like doing a good job and I've normally ranked at the top of the bell curve, shall we say, in most things that I've done. Um, so I, I kind of realized at that point, okay, it's not the job, perhaps, it's the structure. I can't get there from here, where here isn't one particular job, it's one particular way of being. And I found that the job structure didn't allow me the space I needed to, to heal, to, to fully recover from what happened uh, a couple of years ago. So I've been in this kind of dishatched space for a while now. Once I recognize that, I'm very grateful and in many ways lucky that I discovered certain things over the last year and a half perhaps that helped me build my own escape route. So you've seen me be quite active on Twitter and doing various creative things, building an Azan Technique course and all this kind of thing. All of these things have been in service of me wanting to create a lifestyle for myself that would allow me to recover from that burnout experience that never quite went away. Because what I'm doing here is getting to the place where I would start from here. And that's what all of this that you've seen so far has been about. And now it feels like the journey is beginning. Now that I've left not just a job, but the entire structure of work that I think led to me burning out in the first place. So I just wanted to share that story. It's a really important part of where I've come from and will influence the things I talk about and where I'm going from now on. And I'm, I'm happy to say that where I am now, I think actually I would start from here. So thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.